Hey, what's up, Family Feud, week number four. Uh, hello, Western Oklahoma. Hello, thriving metropolis of Oklahoma City. Hello, North Texas, back in my home roots. And hello, my fellow Floridians. Uh, week four. Um, things are really starting to kick off now in the league. Got some great matchups, interesting matchups this week. We've got uh, Battle of the Unbeatens, 3-0 and apiece. Got the Battle of the Winless. Um, somebody's going to get their first win. Somebody's going to be in deep shit. And we got a couple of matches right in the middle on maybe seeing what direction those teams are going to go for the season. Uh, whether they're going to start getting hot and taking off or whether they're going to fall back and really be struggling to find a, a playoff spot. Um, not going to spend a whole lot of time. Gonna, the ball's calling for a little something different this week. I'm going to give you a difference maker in each game um, with a spread. And we're going to do a little breakdown, breakdown of the game of the week because I think it's a really nice matchup of 3-0 and team. So having said all that, let's uh, get right into the picks. Hope you have a great week. Hey, you two, you're both 0-3. I know you both need a little motivation. I don't know what to tell you. I'm going to need some help on this one. Hell of a shot. Sorry, it got wasted. Jeez. I don't know what to do with these guys. I, I beg, I plead, I try to be a nice guy. I'm a nice guy. I, mean, I don't... Huh? They're kids. Scare them. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody in the shower! Anybody in the shower in 10 seconds gonna get fined a hundred dollars! Larry! One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, get in five there. Mississippi, Hurry it up. six Mississippi, I don't know, I don't seven know. Mississippi, Maybe eight Mississippi, out. nine Mississippi, ten Mississippi. You guys. You lollygagged the ball around the infield. You lollygagged your way down to first. You lollygagged in and out of the dugout. Now, you know what that makes you, Larry? Lollygaggers. Lollygaggers. What's our record, Larry? Eight and 16. Eight and 16. How'd we ever win eight? It's a miracle. It's a miracle. This is a simple game. You throw the ball, you hit the ball, you catch the ball. You got it! Here's your difference maker, and here's your pick. Hey nerds, not only does Gangsta beat the hell out of everybody in the league, including you, but he's always, like, up on your wife and... This is kind of how I see that whole situation. Swami is out! May I ask you a question? What do you think of me? What do you mean? You've known me nearly all your life. You must have formed some opinion of me. Well, I always thought that you were a very nice person. Did you know I was an alcoholic? What? Did you know that? Look, I think I should be going. Sit down, Benjamin. Mrs. Robinson, if you don't mind my saying so, this conversation is getting a little strange. Now, I'm sure that Mr. Robinson will be here any minute now. No. What? My husband will be back quite late. He should be gone for several hours. Oh, my God. Pardon? Oh, no, Mrs. Robinson. Oh, no. What's wrong? Mrs. Robinson, you didn't... I mean, you didn't expect... What? I mean, you didn't really think I'd do something like that. <laughs> like what? What do you think? <laughs> well, I don't know. For God's sake, <laughs> Mrs. Robinson. <laughs> Here we are. You got me into your house. You give me a drink. You put on music. Now you start opening up your personal life to me and tell me your husband won't be home for hours. So? Mrs. Robinson, you're trying to seduce me. <laughs> Aren't you? Nice plug and play. I think it makes a difference. Hey, True Blue at Crimson. Listen, I both know you guys are experienced owners. I'm just not seeing uh, the explosiveness out of these two teams that I think that we need to see. 
You know, I know True Blue sitting at two and one. Mike's off to a horrid start. Needs to get something going. I think you both need a motivational speech about right now. You all know what you have to do. Remember, no one, and I mean no one, comes into our house and pushes us around. This is your game now, gentlemen. And for you seniors, it's your last one, so make it count. Because you'll remember it for the rest of your lives. Let's get him. He looked a little bit like his old self. That makes a difference. Hey, when it comes to fantasy football, nothing says family feud like a game against boats and hoes. So, uh, it's going to be a brawl this week. So, get ready. All right. What about your family? Oh, mine? Yeah. It's real easy. Stupid, worthless, no good, goddamn freeloading son of a bitch, retarded, big mouth, know it all, asshole, jerk. You forgot ugly, lazy, and disrespectful. Shut up, bitch! Who flips me turkey pot pie? What about you, Dad? Fuck you. No, Dad. What about you? Fuck you! No, Dad! What about you? Fuck you! Is that for real? You want to come over sometime? That's bullshit. It's all part of your image. I don't believe a word of it. You don't believe me? No. No? Did I stutter? Believe this? Huh? It's about the size of a cigar. Do I stutter? See, this is what you get in my house when you spill paint in the garage. See, I don't think that I need to sit with you fucking dildos anymore. No Gronk certainly makes this guy the difference maker. Hey, what a great game of the week that we have. Uh, Wire Winos have been absolutely just mashing everybody that they're playing. It harkens back to the Texola Taints days. Uh, when he was a dominant force year in and year out. It looks like he's built that kind of squad again. Uh, he stays healthy. It's going to be very, very tough to beat. However, he does run up against his kryptonite this week, also 3-0, Orange Crush, who does it with little smokes, smoke and mirrors. Uh, hey, but 3-0 is 3-0. and uh, Interesting tidbit on this game. 15 career meetings between these two franchises. Winos get the first two. Crush get the next two. They tie in the fifth game, which went to the Winos, and for 10 straight games, the Crush has beaten the Wino. I know that he's got the squad to do it. I know that he wants to do it this week. If he's sitting at 4-0 and he gets it without Brady, uh, look out. We could be in for a record-setting year. But Crush is going to hang around, and uh, let's, let's, let's see a little clip about Game of the Week. There can be only one. Thank <laughs> you. 
This guy is a beast. He's making a difference. Swami is out!